Squirrel stuck in a treehouse. No, I live here. Don't worry, Squirrel. I will save you. No, don't touch me. Okay, so if I place this ladder here, and it's one foot away from the treehouse base, and it's five feet tall, I wonder how big this treehouse base is. Why don't you find out? Okay. No, wait, I was kidding. Okay, so one, one squared plus b squared equals five squared. So, that would be 1 plus b squared equals 25. So, to figure out the leg or the treehouse base, I do 24, 25 minus 1 equals 24, and 1 minus 1 is 0. So now, I have to do the square root of 24, which is 4.9. So that means the treehouse base is 4.9 feet. Don't worry, squirrel. I'm coming. No, don't take me from my home. Gotcha. No! Oh, I got him. Okay, so we're off to the zoo with my wild animal that I caught, and he is a squirrel. Yeah, he's a squirrel. Okay, so let's get out my trusty map here. Okay. So to get to the zoo, it looks like we need to go five miles east on Highway 36 to get to the school and then make a left turn. So let's go. Okay, so there's the school. So then we need to make a left turn 12 miles up Highway 104 to the zoo. So let's do that. Ah, oh, here we are at the zoo. So then when I'm done here, I need to go back to the squirrel tree for more investigations. Huh. This map makes a triangle of my directions. So why don't we look at this? 5 squared plus 12 squared equals c squared. Or in other words, that would be 25 plus 144 equals c squared. So those two added together equal 169. So the square root of 169 is 13 miles. So 13 miles is how far I have to travel to get from the zoo back to the squirrel tree. Can I help you? Yes, I have a wild animal here. What is it? It's a squirrel. Okay, put it in the cage. Okay.